A parliamentary committee has urged the federal government to consider reclaiming Australian ownership of the Darwin port if its long-term lease to a foreign company is found not to be in the national interest. The NT government under the previous CLP administration signed a 99-year lease of the port to Chinese firm Landbridge in 2015. The Joint Standing Committee on Trade and Investment Growth says the federal government should explain if the port deal is subject to new laws allowing the Commonwealth to veto state and territory deals with foreign countries. If the port deal is deemed to be against the national interest, the committee says the federal government should consider returning ownership of the port into Australian hands.